This time I'll play Alien Invaders Plus for the Magnavox Odyssey 2. This time I had to set up my system a little differently. Since the controllers are so short, I had to put the system on the ground. Here's the game, complete in box. Opens up like an Intellivision game. There's the manual. Let's power it on. When you start up the system, you have to go onto the keypad and hit enter. And the game automatically starts, so you have to be ready. You might think this game's just like Space Invaders, but it's a little bit different once you start playing it. The difference is you can't shoot the thing in front. You have to dodge every shot, and you don't score a single point unless you clear the whole level. You're basically competing against the computer every round. Yeah, I don't know. When I bought this game, I was expecting... Oh, this looks like Space Invaders. It plays nothing like it. You only get three chances to get hit. If you use up all those boxes, you don't have a chance of winning. Talk about difficulty. Plus you got that alien in the back shooting at you. Sometimes it'll come down at you and shoot even closer range. Like this. like sneaking around a corner and shooting every time. can't even shoot through a shot made by the enemy. If you can only get those cannons out of the way, then the rest would be much easier. The little people can't shoot. Probably aliens, though. As this is alien invasion. Or alien invaders plus. It's called.
And you have to destroy that as well. Finally, score a point. So the game's pretty simple. The difficulty looks like it increases a bit after clearing the first level, so... Keeps track of how many times you died. The system is just as old as Atari 2600, but it wasn't as successful. Well, that's enough of this game.